In today's video, we're exploring the massive world of truck bed campers. We'll review five innovative models pushing boundaries for function, style, and versatility in an ever-growing market. Learn about the Wanderer Aussie Base Station, the only truck bed camper in the world with a basement. We'll also compare some American and European engineered truck bed campers. Then later on, we'll unveil the truck bed described as an offshore racing yacht built on a trophy truck. I'm Glenn, and let's get to it. Five. When Truck Campers Australia searched for a base for their latest slide-on truck bed camper, they partnered with Canadian-based manufacturer Northern Light. Exporting these massive units cost a pretty penny. Still, when building their latest Aussie base station, Truck Campers Australia says the superior build quality was worth every cent. The result is the Aussie Base Station, a demountable truck bed camper that combines the luxury of a motorhome with the versatility of off-road four-wheel drive. They're built to sit on the back of a Mitsubishi Fuso Canter. When you want to attach the truck to the camper, you simply raise the ABS on its wireless remote-controlled hydraulic legs and reverse your vehicle into place. A docking station mounted to the Fuso's tray locks the basement of the ABS into place. Oh yeah, the Aussie base station has a basement. They're essentially a series of storage lockers that double as a structural foundation and attachment point. When deployed, the Aussie base station stays true to its name expanding awnings and annexes from the front, rear, and sides. Inside, the timber-detailed ABS sleeps up to four, with a queen bed in the front and a convertible dinette bed in the middle. On board, the ABS features creature comforts galore. Everything from satellite TV, air conditioning, roof-mounted solar panels, power inverter, and lithium-ion battery storage. There's a full-featured kitchen, ensuite with commode and shower, and outside, annexes can be used as an additional bedroom, kids' play area, or semi-outdoor dining room. Some owners have even found a way to hook up a small washing machine for outdoor laundry. All in all, lovers of long-haul life on the road feel right at home in the Aussie base station. But could you do three months in a camper like this? Hailing from the Australian coastal city of North Wollongong, Earth Cruiser knows a thing or two about road testing their products. After driving their first ever prototype more than 400 miles across the sand dunes of the Simpson Desert, they then set their sights higher, completing a trek of more than 16,000 miles across Russia and Mongolia. Their focus has always been military-grade off-road expedition vehicles. The Extreme XTR is their most compact truck bed camper yet. Built on the rugged Toyota Land Cruiser 79 series, the XTR is a fully molded single-piece camper with the walls, floor, and roof constructed out of high-density thermal foam. Inside, you'll find room to sleep three, a double bed in the pop-up roof, and a convertible single dinette bed in the galley. There's an internal wet bathroom complete with toilet and shower. The kitchen comes with an induction cooktop, fridge-freezer combo, and stainless steel sink mixer. Power comes courtesy of expandable 450 amp-hour lithium batteries, a 3,000-watt inverter, and 270-watt roof-mounted solar panels. The operations center of the XTR is on a touchscreen interface by FinScan. From here, a whole host of sensor information, automation, and control can be managed. Everything from the navigation to premium infotainment and diagnostics.
Offered as a full conversion, prices for the XTR start at around $150,000, despite it only being available in Australia for the time being. If you're watching from the US, would you buy it at this price if it became available? Three. German engineering company Cabineer has been on a mission to create innovative and sustainable camping cabins for pickups. Their 2022 model certainly looks to tick both boxes. Built to fit most double cab pickup trucks, the Cabineer is made out of natural fiber composite, flax fiber, cork, linseed resin, and treated non-toxic plastics. The result is a solid lightweight molding that is also incredibly environmentally friendly in its production and at the end of its life. The Cabineer also has a focus on accessibility. The fridge, kitchen stove, and cabinetry are accessible from both the inside and outside of the camper, with the rear doors swinging outwards. And that's how owners of the Cabineer prefer to use their camper, a mixture of indoor, outdoor functionality. Inside, the Cabineer sleeps three adults, or two adults and two children, in the convertible dinette bed and expandable roof level. There's no indoor shower, and you will have to settle for a porta potty style situation. Still, the kitchen faucet can be relocated outside to act as an outdoor shower. A fully upgraded Cabineer features a 100 amp hour lithium battery connected to two 100 watt solar panels, a water heater, and a cabin heater with an altitude kit. At the moment, you're only going to be able to pick up a Cabineer if you're in Europe, with their showrooms in Germany. What's your preference when it comes to showering while camping? Is an indoor heated shower a non-negotiable inclusion for you? Let us know in the comments. I'm Allie, and it's Mind's Eye Trivia Time. By looking at just these images, do you know what this is and where it's from? Leave the correct answer or your best guess in the comment section below. Two. If you're craving adventure well off the beaten track but still want a comfortable night's sleep, the next truck bed camper might just pique your interest. Developed in Oregon by Colin and Brad Hauer of Hauer Built Campers, the base camp results from years of research, development, and testing. It's grown from the minimalist Tundra all the way to their first electronic lift pop-top camper in 2022, named the Base Camp. From the outside, the base camp has an industrial strength-like feel to it. A 3 16 inch aluminum frame and powerful electric-driven scissor lift can lift 300 pounds no matter the load distribution. This is incredible, considering the camper itself is only 400 pounds. Measuring 9 feet 4 inches long, with a fully expanded headroom of 6 feet 5 inches, the base camp is designed to fit most mid-sized trucks. A waterproof, UV, and mold-resistant canvas wraps around the pop-up sleeping area. Access comes via the large rear doors and side awning panels. Downstairs in the main cabin, the layout is highly customizable, but many owners have opted for large modules that slide out on rails for cooking, storage, and food prep. The other side can be used for gear hauling, a great place to hold motorbikes, kayaks, and mountain bikes. The base camp sleeps two people on a three-inch thick queen mattress in the pop-up roof. 
three if a bed is installed in the main cabin. There's also a six inch recessed cavity, so when the top is collapsed, the mattress and bedding can be left in place. Power comes courtesy of a 100 amp hour lithium battery, an MPPT controller, and pre-wired solar provisions. This comes in handy when running a 12 volt power plug, eight interior dimmable LED lights, and the two USB ports. Is the base camp more suited to your sense of adventure? Or do you need to camp in style? One. Seemingly created to wait out the apocalypse in luxury and style, the VCT has been described as an offshore racing yacht built on a trophy truck. Engineers at Nevada-based company Truckhouse have only been around since 2019, but their first production-level truck bed camper has many people interested in the new kids on the block. Inspired by the small 4x4 campers of the 1980s, Truckhouse wanted to create modern expedition vehicles ready-built for American adventurers. After years of development, Truckhouse unveiled the BCT, a state-of-the-art Toyota Tacoma conversion with a whole lot of features. Starting with a Tacoma base, Truckhouse created a carbon fiber composite cabin, and seven large windows were added, providing views from every angle. The BCT comfortably sleeps three inside, just like most of our truck bed campers, with a queen and convertible single dinette configuration. Inside is where you'll find most of the luxury inclusions. Some include hydronic heating, retractable skylight, integrated blinds and screens, a 32-inch TV, air conditioning, and a full-size Bosch oven. You'll also find a fully featured wet bath on board, complete with a shower and toilet, Outside, an electric motor deploys an awning and entry step, with a waterproof 10-speaker soundbar providing music regardless of the weather. The Tacoma 2 has gotten an upgrade, with drilled and slotted disc brakes and chunky all-terrain tires boosting its off-road capabilities. Available only in the U.S. for now, 